Hello students, welcome back to the EMS class. Today we are going to discuss plants around us. Children, in class first we learned about plants are living things which need water, air, to grow. There are different types of plants growing in different places. Let us learn more about plant. Let us learn Parts of a plant. Children, plants are fixed to the ground. We can see some parts of plants that grow above the ground. But we cannot see some parts that grow under the ground. That is Root. Let us learn about root. Roots. Roots grow under the ground. They hold the plant to the ground. They absorb water and nutrients from the soil. Water travels through the stem and branches to the leaves. Leaves. Leaves are mostly green in color. They make food for the plant using water and sunlight. Flowers. Flowers are colorful and give out a sweet scent. They produce Fruits and seeds. Fruits. Fruits are the fleshy part of the plant. Some fruits have seeds inside them. These seeds grow into new plants if they receive the right amount of water, air and sunlight. Let us discuss about types of plants. 
there are many kinds of plants they are trees shrubs herbs creepers and climbers let us discuss about trees some plants are big some plants are small trees are big plant with hard and strong stems called trunks for example a mango tree a peepal tree a coconut tree and a fir tree look at this picture these are shrubs shrubs are smaller than trees they have woody stems and grow close to the ground for example a rose plant a tulsi plant a hibiscus plant a tea plant children have you seen herbs let us see about herbs herbs are very small plants with soft green stems for example a coriander plant a mint plant a spinach plant and grass children do you like watermelon what types of plant it is that is creepers some plants grow along the ground they are called creepers for example watermelon plant pumpkin plant cucumber plant children do you know about grapes there are two types of grapes green grapes and black grapes which type of plant it is that is climbers some plants are cannot stand up like trees they need help to stand straight they have weak stems these types of plants are called climbers for example a grape vine a bean plant a pea plant some plants also grow in water this type of plants are called water plants for example a lotus plant a water lily plant a water hyacinth plant children let us learn about how to protect the plants why should we protect the plants because we get many things from plants such as vegetables fruits grains and pulses from the plants we use the wood leaves and flowers to make different things such as 
plates, medicines and juice. Plants keep the air fresh and clean. We should try to grow more plants at home. We need plants in many ways, but a lot of plants being cut. It is because of we are using more and more land to growing food or building houses and factories. Children, how we can help in protecting trees? Let us learn some points. We can protect the plants by using these points. We should not pluck the leaves and flowers of plants for fun. We should use both sides of a paper before throwing it. We should use cloth napkins and bags in place of paper bags. We could borrow, share or donate books. Grow plants and save plants. Children, what we learn from this lesson? Shall we revise once? Plants are living things which need water, air and sunlight to grow. Plants have different parts, roots, stems, branches, leaves, flowers and fruits. Plants are of different types, trees, shrubs, herbs, creepers, climbers and water plants. Plants give us food, wood and many other things. There are many ways to protect trees such as by using less paper, reusing paper, using cloth bags, etc.